Hello everyone and welcome to this Remix Live Finger Drumming tutorial. Today we will see everything you need to know in order to get started with this new version of the app. And by the way, for all the newcomers, welcome. So, here's the main view of the app. The loop grid is composed of loop and FX pads. Each line plays a track and each column corresponds to an instrument. Loop pads are set on loop play mode, meaning that you tap once and it plays in an endless loop. Tap again to stop it. On the other hand, FX pads are either set on one shot, so tap to play the sample once, and tap again to stop the sample, or the sample will stop by itself after being played once. Or on gate, the sample will play for as long as your finger touches the pad. You can also trigger an entire line of samples by swiping your finger across the screen. On the upper part of the screen, you can notice some icons. Tap on the hamburger icon to open the main menu of the app. Here's your sample pack library with all your packs. From here, you can choose a pack to load it on the grid, and you can also edit, import, and create new ones. And here's a store to get some new packs and unlock new features. Note that there are free and discounted packs waiting for you guys in the store. Back to the main screen, here's your metronome, tap on it to launch it. You can also set the BPM with these plus and minus icons. Double tap on it to reset the tempo. And also tap on the BPM to tap your tempo yourself and to reset it. This icon right here is the master clock. Every other clock inside the app is enslaved to this one. Tap on it while you have some pads playing and it will stop the music. Tap again and it will start again. Note that if you tap on it while nothing is playing, it will simply reset the clock. With this Q button, you can set the quantized value of the grid. This feature is tailored to help you always play on the beat, meaning that your samples will always start and end on the beat and sync. So, here's the grid selector. It allows you to switch in between the loop and the finger drumming grid. Tap on drum and land on our brand new finger drumming grid. With this grid, you can play percussions and notes. Those are all one-shot samples. Unlike loops, each pad is like a piano key. They are all set on retrigger play mode, meaning that if you tap to play the sample once, you can replay the pad whenever you want even if the sample is not finished by tapping on it again. This tape recorder icon is a part of our brand new finger drumming feature as it enables you to record your own patterns. Now you can easily record finger drumming sequences to create original patterns. And right next to it, there's a track recorder that allows you to record your entire performance in high quality. Tap on it to start recording, and tap again to stop it. Jump back to the main menu to find all the tracks you have recorded playing the app. And finally, here's your master level meter. Now, on the right side you'll see the view selection buttons allowing you to change views in the app. The first one on which we are since the beginning is called the grid view. Then there's the mixer view with level faders, filters and mute subtle buttons for each channel. The third is the FX view to access your audio effects as well as an XY pad to dose the amount of FX you want to apply. You'll also find 6 beat repeat paths to create rolls and buildups. Choose a specific channel to which you want to apply the FX or the beat repeat. The fourth view is the sample editor, which allows you to edit all your samples with four subsections. General settings, key editor, waveform view with the DSR, and the sample recording. 
And last but not least is the sample collection where you can retrieve all your loops, samples and patterns to add them to the grid. Go back to the main menu and here you can import tracks from your music library to add them to your sample collection. Please note that the maximum length file allowed is 32 seconds. And that's all for this first round of Remix Live finger drumming. Coming soon, we'll take an in-depth look at the pattern recording and the advanced sample editor. I look forward to seeing you soon with a new Remix Live finger drumming tutorial.